Okay, titration calculation answers. Calculate the number of moles in the following. 2 litres of 0 0.05. Capital M means moles per litre. So we use moles equals molarity times volume, MV, which in this case, molarity is 0 0.05. Volume is 2. Let's tidy it up a bit. Times 2. And that comes to 0 0.1 moles. Can we see this? Better in blue. 25 centimetre cubed. 25 centimetre cubed of 0 0.01. Well, in this particular case, oh, we're doing a C next, it doesn't really matter. Moles, molarity equals, so MV gives us the moles. And this equals, well, the molarity is 0 0.01. And the volume, 0 0.025. And that gives us. 0.00025 moles. Fifty liters of five molar sulfuric acid. Well, MV equals molarity times volume five times fifty. And that comes to 250 moles. I'll give it a bit of space here. 250 moles. Let's go over to the next question. 10 centimetre cubed is 0 0.25 molar. Well, molarity times volume equals moles. Molarity 0 0.25. Volume 0 0.01 in litres, of course. And that gives us, well, we move the decimal place, two places to the left, 0025 moles. Question 2. Let's move up to question 2. Calculate the concentration of the following. Well, we just change the moles equals mv equation. Let's go into here. But moles equals mv, well, if we want the molarity, the concentration, M equals moles over V. All right, so let's uh, let's well let's put this check take it out of here. Let's put it in, into this section here so we can see it. I'm going to take it into here. This is our equation. All right, let's let's font that so that we can recognise it. And now, let's just have a look at the questions. Well, what are we given? We're given the moles, 0 0.04, so we want moles equals mol over V, so 0 point, ooh, 0 point, 0 0.4 divided by the volume in litres, which is 2, and that comes to 0 0.2. And its concentration is a capital M. Over here, ah, we're giving it in grams. Well, we need to change the grams to the relative using the relative mass. So we need to also use this equation. I want to put it over here now. So the moles equals the mass divided by the relative mass. So in this particular case, then moles is the mass. So it's 1.05 divided by the relative mass. Sodium is 23, and OH adds up to 40 altogether. So that gives us the number of moles. 1.05 divided by 40. Well, let's have a look at that. 1.05 divided by 40. Take it in. 1.05 over 40. There's our moles, which is 0 0.0263. 0 0.0263. And we've got, this is moles. And we're going to put this into 500 centimetre cubes of solution. Right, so the molarity equals the moles over the volume. So M equals the moles 0 0.0263 over the volume. And the volume is 0 0.5 litres. And that in turn is going to give us, so we divide our term by 0 0.5. And that gives us an answer 0 0.0525.
0.0525 mole oi let's take that back so right. run this back a little bit molar And on to the next part of the question. Remember, moles MV, molarity is moles over V. Well, molarity M equals moles 12.5 over volume, and the volume in this case is 5. Well, 12.5 over 5 is 2.5. Don't even need a calculator. What a crack. There we go. Next one. Now we've got to get the relative formula mass of sodium carbonate. Well, that adds up carefully. It's 106. So it's 2.56 divided by 106. This gives the number of moles. Bring this in. 2.56 divided by 106. 2.56 divided by 106. And that gives us the number of moles, which is 0 0.0242. 0 0.0242 and we're told it's in told that it's in 0 0.25 liters so it's 0 0.0242 divided by 0 0.25 and what we do just divide our number in the calculator by 0.25 and this gives me 0 0.0966. 0 0.0966. 0 .0 Mola. Alright, we'll go on to question 3 in the next video.